Welcome to this video about studying law at the University of Limerick. My name is Dr. Laura Cahalan, and I'm a lecturer at the School of Law here in Limerick. As a young person, trying to decide on a career path is a very difficult decision. You may have considered law as a potential career option, but because you have not studied this subject in school, you might be wondering what studying law is actually like. Many people have misperceptions about law. They think it's all about learning off long lists of old rules. Now, law does have rules and traditions, and admittedly, some are a little archaic, such as the fact that barristers and judges wear wigs and long black gowns. The tradition of wearing the gowns actually dates back to 1714, when the British Queen Anne died and the King ordered the whole legal profession into mourning. But law also involves lots of useful rules in order to regulate society. For example, we need to know whether something is a crime or not. It might seem there's an obvious answer to that question, but let me give you a scenario. If you're tackled in the street by a random individual, we're pretty confident in saying that is a crime. But let's say you're playing a game of rugby or football and you're tackled in the game, but contrary to the rules of the game. Is that a crime? These are the sorts of questions that law has to grapple with. But law is much wider than that. In fact, law permeates every cell of social life, from life before birth to what happens when you die. Law regulates the air that we breathe, the food and drink we consume, our travel, sexuality, family relationships, property, sport, employment, education, health, everything from a dispute with your neighbour to all out war. It also teaches you logical thinking, articulate expression of complex ideas, the composition and art of an argument, how to use evidence and rules, and how our state functions. It's important to note also that just because you study law, it doesn't mean you have to become a barrister or a solicitor because a law degree is the most adaptable of academic qualifications. Many world leaders and most of our presidents have had law degrees. Lots of our graduates have gone on to careers in diverse areas like business, politics, finance, media and journalism, academia, working with organizations like the UN, humanitarian organizations, and working in the European Union institutions. A law degree is seen as a stamp of excellence by employers and will open up so many opportunities. In the School of Law at UL, we have a number of different degree options. I'm going to tell you a bit about these shortly, but first of all, let me tell you a little bit about the School of Law itself. Our school has won a number of awards including Law School of the Year, Postgraduate Course of the Year for our Master's Programme, and a prestigious Excellence in Teaching and Assessment Award. All of this shows the passion that our lecturers have and the fact that our courses are world-class. We strive to create a student-centred learning environment at the University of Limerick, and we're lucky to have amazing resources, such as two moot court rooms, where students can practice their real world advocacy skills and a state of the art new law library. Many of our lecturers in the School of Law are internationally recognized experts in their field. And we have highly distinguished guest lecturers, such as judges and practitioners, and often staff from international universities. For example, two years ago, we had Dean Strang from the Netflix series, Making a Murderer. We're lucky to have an exceptionally high employment rate across all of our degrees. In fact, UL has the highest rate of graduate employment in Ireland. It's about 22% higher than the national average. Our law and accountancy students, for example, have an almost perfect 100% employment rate across a five-year period. A key driver of this is our co-op placement programme. All of our degrees involve an element of work experience or co-op where students gain really useful insights into the world of work during their degree, something which is a huge asset on graduation. We also have the largest exchange programme of any university in Ireland. 
For example, in the School of Law, we have links with the University of Texas, the University of Victoria, Dalhousie University, the University of Canterbury, and many others. So there are wonderful study abroad opportunities and students can choose to spend a semester studying in an international university as part of their degree. So let me tell you about our degree programmes. We have three undergraduate programmes in the School of Law, Law Plus, Law and Accounting, and the BA in Criminal Justice. Law Plus is essentially a law degree, but with a little something extra. It is a full law degree, so you'll study all of the same subjects as you would in a straight law degree. But you can also study an extra subject. That extra might be a language or a subject from the humanities, something from psychology or economics. We will look at all of those elective pathways in a minute. The way Law Plus is designed is that you can tailor your degree. You can decide to make your degree 80% law or 60% law. If you decide to have 80% law, you will choose one other non-law pathway to study alongside your law degree. If you decide to have 60% law, you can choose two non-law pathways to study alongside your law degree. This means that each semester you would study three core law modules plus two elective modules. You will study all of the core law subjects, such as introduction to lawyering, criminal law, contract law, constitutional law, tort, land law, equity and trusts, the law of the European Union and advanced lawyering subjects. If you choose the 80% law option, then you choose an additional law subject as one of your elective subjects. Your other elective subject would be in the discipline that you've chosen as your elective pathway. You have a wide range of choice in terms of your elective pathway. You can study different languages, including Irish, French, Spanish, and German. You could also study Japanese and English language teaching. You have subjects like mathematics, economics, psychology, politics and history, sociology, digital culture and communications, and public administration. If you choose the 80% law option and take an additional law elective module, there are many other law modules outside of the core modules that you can choose to study. So why should you choose Law Plus? In terms of graduates going for interviews after their degree, the Law Plus course brings something extra. It's such a unique program in that you have the traditional law degree, but also the opportunity to study other subjects. There's also an emphasis on practical skills and clinical legal education. We have our moot courts and we have specialised lawyering modules. We also have co-op education or work placement as part of the programme. You also have opportunities to compete in and win national and international competitions. And you have lots of opportunities to study and work abroad, including Erasmus programmes, internships and work placements. The Law and Accounting course is what we call a joint honours degree. This is because essentially you're getting a law degree and an accounting degree all in the one course. The fact that after this course that you have a full law degree and a full accounting degree means our graduates are highly sought after. One important point to note is that there is no presumption of prior knowledge in either discipline. This means you do not have to have studied accountancy for Leaving Cert. Accountancy begins on the basis of first principles when you enter university. Obviously, the same goes for law. The Law and Accounting course also includes a co-op placement programme in year three where students have the opportunity to apply the knowledge that they have learned in their course in the workplace. Students can choose to go on co-op in either the law setting or the accountancy setting. This gives them a great insight into their potential career path and allows them to make more informed choices. In terms of the modules that you would study in law and accounting, you will cover all of the core subjects needed in both disciplines. 
So for example, in law, you cover all of the same core modules as the Law Plus degree. And in accounting, you will cover all of the core modules needed later on for the professional exams. You also have the option of undertaking a final year project in year four on one of the chosen disciplines. So why should you choose law and accounting? The employability rate in this course is outstanding. And as I mentioned, graduates from this course are highly sought after from both disciplines. This is because a law graduate who also has a competence in accountancy is a valuable asset, as is an accountant who has a competency in law. This means you have a diverse range of career options open to you on both the accountancy and the finance side, but also on the legal side. You will have access to all of our amazing facilities, such as the moot courtrooms in the School of Law and the trading floor in the business school. In the Law and Accounting degree, you will gain exemptions from the professional exams that you will need to take later on in order to become a chartered accountant. Also, in terms of law, the degree is a recognised degree for the King's Inns, although you may need to take additional modules, and it is also a recognised degree for the Law Society if you want to become a solicitor. Finally, we'll talk about the BA in Criminal Justice. This is a modern and innovative interdisciplinary programme in that it combines the study of law with other modules like sociology, politics, public administration, psychology and management. We have a considerable body of expertise built up in this area over time in the School of Law. For example, we have the Centre for Criminal Justice and Victim Studies. We also accredit the Garda Training Programme at Temple Moor. We have an Applied Policing Programme, as well as postgraduate diplomas in serious crime investigation. We also have links with other criminal justice stakeholders and victim support organisations, as well as government departments. With Law Plus, you can take law and sociology, for example, or law and politics, or law and public administration. But in the BA in Criminal Justice, all of these modules are brought together in this particular programme under the broad heading of criminal justice. So you have high employability prospects in areas such as policing, security, the courts, the prison service, and non-governmental organisations, such as victim support organisations. As part of the programme, you study a selection of law modules, such as constitutional law, criminal procedure, evidence, human rights, and there are many other subjects from the other disciplines which you will also study. It's important to note that the criminal justice degree is not a law degree. However, graduates of the criminal justice degree are eligible for exemptions which allow them to complete a one-year LLB degree after their original degree. This means you can obtain a full law degree in one year after studying the BA in Criminal Justice. So why should you choose to study the BA in Criminal Justice? If you're interested in a career in the area of crime and criminal justice, this is the ideal course for you. You also have a huge amount of flexibility in this course, because of the option of obtaining a law degree in one additional year following your degree. In the School of Law, we also run lots of activities for second level students. We have a dedicated secondary schools portal on our website, and you should keep an eye on this for details. Each year, for example, we run a transition year experience and also Law for a Day, where students get to experience a day in the life of a law student, where you can attend lectures, meet current students, undertake a moot court trial and meet lecturers. For details on these and more events, keep an eye on our website. If you would like to follow up with further questions or anything in relation to the School of Law or our degrees, please email us at law at ul.ie and we will be happy to answer any questions you may have. I hope you found this presentation useful.